Somebody tears up the uh, battery sticker on that. that sucks. <laughs> oh, that's TRX model. Can't even tell. <laughs> the lighting. I don't want here. Shit, forty-five thousand. It's high end models. <laughs> this one's hilarious. Shit, 61,000. Like trucks have really gone up in price. Something you don't, something, something you don't normally see in lots anymore. Base model ones. Those XL. So 32,000. These are chrome all over. I don't need that. Probably equipment group who needs that. I'd probably just get the cheapest one here they have anyway. <laughs> oh. Nothing inside. Well. No, I'd say if I buy a bought one. I'd say if I ever bought one, the perfect one would probably be this configuration long bed, no back seat. They have no features. They have no features inside. <laughs> there is TX. I think. Tell you for what they charge for trucks nowadays. For pickup trucks. <laughs> it's like so many expensive ass vehicles. This be a time when uh. It's a big time when they never charge, when they never wear any truck, no, or no truck. And a light day, retail for more than say 25,000 at one time. Back in the old days. Look how many they got. That's what they charge anyway. There is TX. Any question people ask, how do Vogue's uh, Ole ever put up with, uh, with the vehicle she buys? Look at that XLT. $51,000. Well, I'm mine. Super crew. Forty-five thousand for that. <laughs> so it's got a nice uh, spray and bed liner. I think the drop is better anyway. I think drop is much more practical. But I would buy if I had the money. So much fucking money to charge. I saw some helicopter and so many. these are all 2018 models. <laughs> and I always ask how, how can auto vlogs all lay even live with say the vehicle she's she drives. It's better looking than, what, than the truck we got access to. When we have access to, don't have that navigation shit. It's good ones anyway. That's all. So many trucks, what they charge nowadays. Every day ones probably cost more. Way more. Everybody's buying them like hotcakes, like everybody and their mothers. <laughs> or cheaper one here. So it's more practical.
thousand dollars for that. Thirty-two, three seventy. <laughs> it's got a bed one here. Nice drop in bed liner. <laughs> nice looking beam. They're nice looking vehicles anyway. <laughs> nice looking. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's ironic. This is the ironic part of the whole video. I have like himself test drove an expedition, but his was like the when he test drove the max model is like the top of the line one. This is a more lower end model. I think it was like four I think this one was like less than fifty. <laughs> There's new expeditions. This is like the non max model. Nice looking too. <laughs> so they're gonna make an SUV like if they're gonna make an expedition max that sells for eighty thousand. They should just make sure that the uh, that one link it off, make sure the Navigator can retail for more fully loaded. It's like the XLT. Nice one too. <laughs> this is like what well, no say forty eight thousand or whatever. Forty-five to fifty thousand. They're gonna turn this video off. Nice shit, anyway. It's like a demo out here. <laughs> this is not all. This and this is not all the pickups they have. They have heavy duty ones elsewhere. <laughs> I'm saying cheaper base models. I should anyway. I figured the car's getting inspected, so hmm. I'll get a video of this one. One of those nice automotive videos. So many pickups, so many. <laughs> it's like everybody in their, it's like it's like everybody in their mother's uh one to one fifties these days. <laughs> Another one with the ladder racks coming down the street. <laughs> We'll have 2018 models. More inventory. <laughs> a nice dump. Nice small dump truck. Nice. Over thirty-seven thousand. One be bought, but one sells a diesel. Nice place to set up. It keeps out heavy duty vehicles up here. And this chassis cab on. That's one of the diesel. Nice to put the fuel filler. And you can't see it here, but this is the exhaust fluid. Seems like all these diesel car vehicles had that exhaust fluid. Tanks over there. You know, I see a certified clean idol. So they're clean skies. Certified clean idol from Mexifornia, or I mean, or I mean California. <coughs> no one here would know. 35,000. This one's probably gonna be like <laughs> nice to go with the diesel. So unfortunately it's nighttime and uh it's unusually warm anyway. Not, not warm I mean. Unusually warmer. 
So you make this the second part of the video. No fancy ass shit there. To be perfect, this is the F-350. And had a diesel. I do that with an F-550, it would be a bird choice. A nice one, your four-wheel drive. A little bit more loaded. <laughs> Charge so much for trucks these days. Shit. That's bare. <laughs> Focusing. So you're nice and old. Say so you're trying to connect. Yeah, 2018 model. 24,000. <laughs> Be better if it's head. That's why I like the symmetrical back doors. Who needs lift gates anyway? They were smart, you should just take all the Siennas and the Odysseys and the fucking Pacificas. Make them, make the automakers and make them redesign their vehicles to say, replacing the uh, lift gates with uh, symmetrical rear, rear doors. They don't have to get lift gates completely. They can always make it an op they can always just make it an option. <laughs> and all the series one's like, like a 2017 <laughs> she just wants 31,000 it's got the V10 I'm gonna go right at yeah, hey then yeah I forgot to stop the V10 for the E series nice one too A lot nicer if it had D's on it. A lot nicer if it had D's on it. Oh, at least you could buy a transit. Stripped on the inside. Shit. Special order fleet. It's a nice vehicle there. Hmm. Transit with no hubcaps. Full size one. Oh shit, keyless entry. Be nice to have. <laughs> like some else too. This one's like high roof. Kind of like that. I think the perfect trans would be like a, it's a single rear wheel 350 model. The high roof, long wheel base. Oh yeah, extended length. That'd be the perfect one right there. And to say what it does with a diesel. Perfect. As if the special or this one's a bitch, it's too. Looks like some used ones in the back. Oh yeah. Can't see that very well, it's a 1990s Ford. This old fashioned four wheel covers and he's got snow on it. I think they use that one in the winter time. Didn't use that around in the winter time. The pavement here. You should pave this. All the work on the more work on the miles they have are like across over there by main road. Charge so much for trucks these days. Charge so much. Even though they charge for pickup trucks. <laughs> you know, I say how a lot of old lady put up with it. How would she put up with, say, driving a heavy duty truck like this? <laughs> Especially if you had a diesel, like, when you charge out the ass to fill up. Well, it's 
pretty much it from all. Now, it's, now I can say it's it for this video.